Hey babies, welcome to Donna Spot with me, Donna. Last year I had came up with some ideas that I wanted to do and didn't wind up doing them because I was moving. And yeah, I've been here since July, but I'm older with a lot of health issues and it takes me a little longer to get things together than most people. Anywho, I plan on doing some gardening this year. I'm going to buy some potting soil. I'm going to use some plain tap water. I saw these little plastic starter pots. Oh, goodness. From the Dollar Tree. And you get a, a nice amount, you know, and they're a nice size to start with. And I'm going to take some of these seeds that I'm going to show you that I bought from there. And I'm going to put some potting soil in here. I'm going to put the seeds in here. And I'm going to take it, take these out individually and put them on an odd plate. And then I'm going to just set them on my kitchen island or whatever and water them every day. And hopefully... As the weather gets better, starting April 1st, I'm going to get enough pots up for the seeds that I bought. Probably I'll buy some more seeds of the same thing. And you can buy food seeds on food stamps if you didn't know. And I'm going to put seeds in these pots and, you know, start them off and let them grow out some. And by the time I'm ready to set them outside on my balcony, hopefully they'll be, you know, you can see them start sprouting. Then I'll take these out. I'll cut the pots off because they're plastic. And I'll transfer them to a pot and put more, more soil in there, some more tap water, and hey, I want to see what it does. So most of these seeds say anywhere from 60 to 80 something days, 90 days. The way I figured it out, if I put everything out on the balcony April 1st, hopefully it won't be as much snow out there. And um, because we haven't had much snow. We just had to the winter blizzard and we had a little snow here and there, but it's still winter, so you never know. But um I wanna put these out here and see what I can do. All of these were bought from Dollar Tree. They're all for four dollar or a quarter a piece. And I just wanted to see what I could do. So I got broccoli. I got fruits and vegetables of what I like to eat. I got some cherry tomatoes. Which I'm allergic to tomatoes, but I love them. I got some dark green zucchini. I have some sweet peppers. Some eggplant. Some spinach. Some green beans. Some corn on the cob some hot peppers, some different types of hot peppers, and another different type of hot peppers, and some cucumbers, some lettuce, some sweet peppers, some cantaloupe, and some watermelon. Now, most of these packets say put like six to eight seeds in there. Whatever is in here, I'm going to just put them in the soil. And I might, uh, knowing me, I'm going to go back and get some more of these different um, vegetables and fruits. You know, I'm not going to say I'm going to get $4. I'm not going to say I'm going to get a dollar's worth of these stuff. But I might go get another one. You know, start off with 50 cents. I started to do that, but I didn't. But, um, start them off, you know, put them in the pot. Grow them in those little starters and then transfer them to another pot with, and then put the whole packet in and then more than likely I'll get some more and I'll put another whole packet in and that should be enough to start with even though they say six to eight. 
I want to have a little bit low because you never know. I don't know what this economy is going to be like. I don't know what's going to happen. So since I don't know what's going to happen, I'm going to go buy me some more seeds and plant, you know, a nice amount of seeds in pots. And, hey, I can grow me some food. And if it ain't great for this year, for... 2023 summer, hopefully it'll be great for 2024 summer, but I'm hoping it'll be good for the summer and growing into the fall and I can have a variety of the things that I like to eat and um, let's get it cracking. I'm going to get them, I'm going to get them long planters for like the bigger stuff like the watermelon, the cantaloupe. Um, the corn on the cob, definitely put corn on the cob, and, um, the egg plant, you know, any, anything that has some length to it, the zucchini, and I'm going to hopefully, I hope all this yields some vegetables and some fruits for me this year. And then knowing me, if, if it's enough where it, um, gives me a lot, I'll share it with family and friends. So wish me good luck on it. First time gardening using potting soil. And um, I just want to see what's going, what's going to happen. I'm hoping it work out. I'm going to get me some little trays here and some little trays there, you know, depending on how I feel and what I feel like here. And then I'm going to do what I got to do because things is getting hard and I'm not the type of person to wait to the last minute while things is getting hard. I want to get it where I can get it and start it off like I need to start it off. And by the time when things get bad and it hit higher, I'll be having my fruits or vegetables and I'll be looking for more fruits and vegetables. And knowing me, I'll probably just fill my whole balcony, except for a space for sitting out there and just do grow my fruits and vegetables. So if that's an idea that you were thinking about doing or... um. If it's something that you do on the regular here in the Buffalo, New York area or anywhere else, please let me know. Please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when it when I'm uploading. Give me a thumbs up and share my videos with your families and friends. And um, leave me a comment. I love interacting with y'all. So until next time. I'll see you later. Love you.